So in this video, I'm going to show you how to connect all of your Game Boys, uh, such as Game Boy Advance, Game Boy SP, uh, Game Boy Color, or original Game Boy to your PC. Um, so here is my Game Boy Advance. Um, so this one's a little complicated. Uh, the way I do it is I got a Game Boy Player, which I attached to the bottom of my GameCube, and I included the startup disc, which I'll show you right here. So the startup disc essentially looks like so. And it's a Game Boy Player startup disc, and it has no scratches. So you need the startup disc on, you turn the GameCube on, and uh, you don't need to connect to your Game Boy. You just plug in the cartridge down here, and you can play with the GameCube uh, controller in the GameCube. And uh, you just need to make sure that you get a good cartridge, otherwise you might not be able to save. I was able to play original Game Boy, I was able to play Game Boy Color and Game Boy Advance games on my PC, and also stream them. Okay, so I purchased a Game Boy Player and a startup disc without scratches from eBay, and essentially you attach that to the bottom of the GameCube and put a Game Boy cartridge in there. I purchased this cable HDMI converter from Amazon. The right cable goes in the back of the GameCube, the left cable goes into the Elgato, like so. Okay, so this picture here is of my Elgato HD60S. They also have a 4K version. Uh, so essentially, you can see the HDMI converter is plugged in right here, and then the smaller cable to its right is the USB 3.0, and that is also plugged into the on the side that says in on the Elgato HD60S. So nothing is plugged in on the side that says out. Uh, so essentially the HDMI gets plugged into this side of the Elgato HD60S, and it also gets plugged into the console where you normally plug in the red, white, and yellow cables. And then that USB 3.0 is plugged in here. It's included with the Elgato HD60S, and it's also plugged into your PC tower. This is the Elgato website. Um, basically here you at this link at the top, you select whichever product at the bottom that you purchased, uh, whichever hardware you purchased for the Elgato. I have the HD60S personally, but they have a 4K one now too. And you select whatever you have, like Windows or whatever. And then essentially what you're going to do is scroll down to the bottom and you select download the 4K capture utility. And essentially um, what you're going to do is open that up and uh, once you plug in your console into the inside of the Elgato cable, and you also plug in the Elgato into your PC tower, then uh, you turn on the console and open up your 4K capture utility, and your game will be right there, just like you could see on my streams on Wall Street Bets on Twitch. So thank you for watching my video. I hope that was helpful. And lastly, here is a heavy-duty outlet. In case you have a powerful PC, I recommend using this because it's safer and more energy efficient.